second part of the chapter deals with what angular displacement theta angular velocity omega angular acceleration so what is angular displacement center of the circle initial position is a and a particle moves to a new position b say this is a part of the circle this is a part of a big circle of radius r it has moved this radius vector has turned from an original position a to the final position it has covered some angle theta this length is l then <coughs> how do you define angular displacement angle traced by radius vector r so as per definition it is angle traced by radius vector r 1 in this case this comes out to what theta the relationship angle is defined as yes length of arc it is a ratio of length of arc to radius as an example if a particle turns through full circle starting from a ends up at a back that means this case then the angle turned is sorry distance covered is 2 pi r and the radius is r so the angle turned is 2 pi radian 1 second part of the same is units si units yes radian is si units dimensions length dimensions of angle is same as that of dimensions of length divided by radius that is also length so what you get is m0 l0 t0 so it is a dimensionless parameter constant or variable varies dimensionless but it has units of radian si unit is written time with you is 2 minutes once again angular displacement is what angle covered theta angle traced by radius vector r theta is equal to what l by r example if a particle covers a full circle then 2 pi r is the total distance covered divided by radius it comes out to be 2 pi radian units si units for angle radian no doubt you use degrees also but si unit is radians and dimensions yes length by length m0 l0 t0 this is a part question number 3 b part angular velocity units dimensions and one more part direction first part definition angular velocity suppose this angle small angle covered particle moves from a to b and small angle covered is d theta now how much time dt time say this length is also small dl 
then angular velocity is defined as yes time rate of a change of angular displacement that means what time rate of change of angular displacement means what omega is equal to d theta by dt rate of a change of angle with the time. So, this is how omega is defined we will discuss direction at the end units SI units yes angle radian time dimensions angle is dimensionless m 0 l 0 t 0 this is the dimensions for angle dimensions for time yes angle is dimensionless we have written time is t 1 so dimensional formula for omega is m 0 l 0 t you shift in a numerator t minus 1 time with you is 3 minutes to write then we will discuss direction 3 minutes to write one part direction yes number one omega is axial vector means what it acts along the axis how if there is a particle moving in a circle then omega is along this particle is moving in this plane horizontal plane circle omega is along the axis axial or term used is axle for example in a car there is a wheel fine another wheel connecting the two wheel is axel that means axis of a rotation how if as seen by you if you say the particle is moving anti clockwise particle is moving anti clockwise then it is towards the reader it can be two axis can have two directions one is towards the reader second is into so you will have to define if a particle moves in anti clockwise direction as seen by the observer then it is towards the reader how do you mark towards the reader like this point if you say as seen by you is anti clockwise like this then it is towards let us go through what direction is omega is axial vector 1 towards the reader towards the reader if reader says what anti clockwise if reader or observer says anti clockwise it is towards the reader away from the reader for clockwise that means what if you say
then as seen by you it is clockwise as seen by me anti clockwise so it is towards me if it is towards me as seen by you it is away that is why away this is away from the reader this is towards the reader time with you is 2 minutes to complete 2 minutes to complete first diagram particle is moving anti clockwise omega wave from the reader when particle moves in anti clockwise direction it is wrong it is towards the reader <coughs> similarly second part also omega is an axial vector 1 2 if the observer says anti clockwise particle is moving anti clockwise then it is towards the reader example find omega of r hand in a clock notes band kar do omega for r hand R hand when R hand completes one circle one cycle yes what is angle covered yes omega is equal to angle covered by time taken angle covered 360 degree but in SI it is 2 pi radian how much time it takes yes how many hours 12 hours so it is pi by 6 radian per hour you may have question in competition where r it may be in terms of minutes radian per minute if you want to change it to radian per minute one hour is equal to how many minutes 60 minutes so it can be pi by 6 radian 1 hour is 60 minutes so in competition you may have pi by 360 radian per minute as one of the choices or radian per second also how you change it you can change a minute to seconds